Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Baby Burns channel. How are you guys doing? It's been a long time. I know that I've been so busy. I can't wait for summer holidays. Um, recently in the mail, I received happy mail from my friend Daisy. Daisy and I are getting a very, very close. She's becoming my number one bestie and I love her so much. Her and I have exchanged, while well, she's sent me happy mail before, I have been building up a stash to send to her. And, um, but she surprised me immensely by her recent happy mail. And I can't believe what she sent me. It's amazing. This is the very first time I've owned a doll like this. But this is a Maple Leah. A Maple Leah doll. They are exactly like the AG dolls, the American Girl dolls. And um, isn't there another doll like this, an 18 inch? Uh, <laughs> all my life, my life, I can't remember. I don't collect these dolls. The first doll, but you know what? I can't wait to open up. I did not open her yet. I kept her in the box. This is a Seva doll. She is an Inuit doll, which is me. I'm Inuit. Daisy told me that <laughs> she reminds me of me. And the best thing is, is that Daisy has a Seva too, and she named her Sedna. So Sedna and this one here, which I'll tell you her name very soon, will be Soul Twin Sisters forever. <laughs> so thank you so much, Daisy. When I opened her, I can't believe she sent me this. I was, the first thing that I said was, what did she do? <laughs> I said it like that. I did not open her though. I did open the box and I noticed that she comes with a journal. And, um, if you're not aware, my biological mother is Inuit. I was not raised Inuit, but, um, I do want to learn more about my heritage. So, um, there's actually in this box, there is a, so, there is this. And her eyes open and close, which I didn't even know about these dolls. It comes with a journal. <laughs> and I was so surprised how, like, the quality. Like, this is, this is real, like a real journal. And the paper in here is, like, amazing. Um, but it's Inuit things in here and even their language. Um, I would like to learn Nuktitut, Nuktitut, <laughs> Nuktitut. The only thing about this language is that there are certain sounds in the Inuk, like Inuit language, that is difficult for me to pronounce. Um, they have certain sounds. Like, for instance, um, my half-sister, uh, Kiatuk, um, <laughs> I remember the first, it's, it's a Q, Q, uh, A-I-S-K-U-T, and I wasn't sure how to pronounce it, and I remember I spoke with some of my cousins, of my and my Inuit side and they're trying I'm saying how do you say that like K is the Q like a K sound like K -K, and it's not exactly like a K so I was trying to say like Kiatsik but it's not Kiatsik it's like K that K that sound is very I can't do it so I would love to learn though 
because my biological mother is completely Inuit and so that means I'm half and <laughs> I would really love to learn but my friend Daisy um, she wants she is fully wanting me to embrace that whole side of me so she supports me 100% so thank you so much Daisy for that but it's kind of cool this this um journal is in uh i'm not sure which dialect like inuktitut or if it's in um or if they have like the same inuit language like written language um it, it's in english of course um and then see there's um this language it'd be so cool to read this one day or even pronounce it properly but also there's french which i also do understand some french journal and uh, sorry <laughs> french is also their second language um inuktitut is their first and then they learn french and then they learn english so I can and and I could brush up on my French, <laughs> but I never opened her yet. Let's open her together. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited! And her accessories are amazing. <laughs> so the star of my car seat this week is Amka. She is um, a mini me actually. She's a premium size. But anyways, <laughs> this is a boat and her. I want to tell you her name. Her name will be Kapik. And I'm not sure. I'm not sure even if I said that properly. But you spell it K-A-P-I-K. -K, and that's my real mother's. Her English name is Rosemary. So her English name will be Rosemary. But her Anuk name will be Kapik. Kap, like Kapik. Kapik. I, uh, it's difficult. So I didn't open her yet. I'm not sure how to dig into here without ruining the box. Because I don't want to ruin this beautiful box. I love how it's like magnetized right here. That's so cool. It's a really nice box. I didn't know that she had a cloth body.
Wow. We have boots. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> She's so beautiful. Does she look like me? Can she look like me? She's so beautiful. <laughs> My eyebrows are thicker. I don't own any dolls of this. She's my first one. It's I love her. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Daisy, thank you so much. She is beautiful. She is my, she's the soul twin sister of Sedna. Oh, and guess what? This is, look at, this is what Francis got me for uh, Valentine's Day. It was part of the gift, and it's a perfect polar bear. <laughs> for Cupic, Cupic. I have to learn how to say that properly. Kapik, 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 kapik. Rosemary. <laughs> Her English name is Rosemary, but it's kapik. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for being here so much and for being a loyal part of my family. I love it so much. Thank you guys for still being here, even though I didn't do a video in a long time. <sighs> Thank you guys. Until next time, very, very soon. Bye, guys. Bye from me. And say hi to Sedna. Hi, Sedna and Daisy. Yes. <laughs>